Hi, I'm Richard. And I'm Jackie. And we're Early Retirement Wonderlust. We're actually on the shores of Lake Annecy at the moment and we're on our way to our winter ski holiday. So as I said, we're on the shores of Lake Annecy. It is Friday afternoon. We started this journey on Wednesday lunchtime from Yorkshire. We drove down to Dover um, after visiting Richard's mum before we go. We had um, a brilliant wild camp, probably one of the most <laughs> epic wild camps ever in Dover. Dover's so pretty at this time of year. Um, we actually camped behind the police station, so we were nice and early for the ferry. It was fab, it was quiet. And then we had a really good run yesterday all the way down through France. Driving in Europe is just so easy. Uh, you can just put it in cruise control at 70, go all the way. And uh, we just kept going. Yeah, we weren't intending on coming as far down as we did. We stayed in a place called bourg en bresse uh, which we have stayed in before. It's about an hour north of Geneva. Um, it's got us quite close to Annecy. We've, so we've actually had a day just touring around Annecy and having a look around. When we did that drive in the summer, I was absolutely <laughs> broken and had to have a nana nap halfway <laughs> down the motorway. Uh, whereas I must be getting a little bit better um, at driving because we were all okay. And uh, yeah, it was a good trip down. So looking forward to the snow. It's a beautiful morning and as you can see we are oh so close to the Alps we can just almost touch them over there we had a really quiet night last night found a beautiful little park up um, and we're about 15-20 minutes from Albeville where we're going to do our big old shop and then we're really excited because the kids are going to join us they're flying out this morning and hopefully we'll all meet up in the chalet
probably gathered we made it. We made it last night. The uh, the conditions, there was no snow. There was no snow this morning. We've been up the mountain two hours later. It's absolutely honking it down. It's going to be a good week. <laughs> yeah, we woke up this morning and it's a proper winter wonderland because at village level there wasn't much snow yesterday. You can always tell when it snowed because Jackie's volunteered to come with me on the bread run for the morning. That doesn't normally happen. <laughs> it's absolutely gorgeous. Kids are still in bed, as you would expect. Nothing's changed since they were uh, they were teenagers and even though they're mid-twenties they still like the sleep. So we're we're doing the bread run for them. But really, really looking forward to fab day on the snow because yeah, you need to get up in them mountains. The moon's still out. The sky is bluish. We'll catch you later. Bye. We've just woken up on day three um, and as predicted we've had over a foot of snow overnight. Me and Luke have just been down for bread. It's unreal so the race is on to get first lifts and get out there. Peace bashers have been out all night. It is going to be an epic day and just so excited. We were chatting about it. It's, it's probably going to be once in a 10 year ski day hopefully. Fingers crossed. Morning from the Alps again day four another bread run on my own today and I actually quite like that everyone's in bed after what was an absolutely epic day yesterday we skied four miles we were up on the first lift because the snow conditions were so unbelievably good after a storm the night before and the peace bashers had gone out and done their stuff we got first lifts and Skiing on that corduroy uh, in deserted forests was just, yeah, you can't really put a price on that. That's why we love the Alps so much and that's why we come skiing. And to be able to do that with the kids and their partners was just magical. It was also Molly's birthday, so belated happy birthday, Molly. I think she had a cracker of a day. Couldn't have got much better in terms of skiing. In our 10, 15 years of skiing, we haven't had any better conditions than that. Today, a bit of a lazy start. Everyone's in bed. I'm doing the bread run. We'll probably have a bit of a poodle and a bit of a lazier day because, as I say, the conditions were so good yesterday, we just battered ourselves and the legs are feeling tired. 
we were all tucked up in bed very early and have all slept really well, having drunk not very much at all because we were that tired.